Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. It's Eva from Bohemian Crafting. Today I'm coming to share with you my new design. It's right now on Etsy. And it was uh, inspired by last year Christmas. I received the gift, gift card for coffee in gift card holder, which was <laughs> made by my amazing friend. She's not crafter. She doesn't craft at all, but she wanted to make something like handmade so in that paper in that cup for coffee the the one something like this she just smash it down make it flat and inside she put she put a gift card for coffees and she said hey here here you go you've got a handmade gift card holder and it was so funny and she made me so happy and I do remember that uh, so it was a huge inspiration for me to create digitals with gift card holders or it can be insert for your journals it can be also as a like card for your friends it doesn't have to hold gift card for coffee or maybe for some some another shops not with coffee but it can be just you will write down some message for your friends this is the holder base i do have three designs this one and this one with very soft snowflakes hopefully you will see that it's very soft design with snowflakes on it and it does have that coffee holder that uh, belly band all of them and it does have small tack small tack and kind of like gift tack which uh, which is going on that belly band and these cards are going inside so i'm gonna cut out all these pieces and i'm gonna put them together So I do have all pieces cut. It. I did print out on 160 GSM paper, which is not too strong. It's not like cardstock. So I'm going to be reinforcing these two pieces of each uh, on each of these kind of like kits or I'm not sure how to say that. Uh, I cut uh, from white cardstock from 250 GSM cardstock, I cut it circles, uh, it is one and a half inch and they are actually really nicely in, in the really good size I want to say. <laughs> so I'm gonna be using these one and a half circles to reinforce these snowflake tags and I'm just gonna glue my mini snowflake tag on this circle and then I will punch the hole I'm gonna let it dry so I'm gonna glue all of them exactly same all three of them so all three holders they do have similar things they do have same tag let it snow same this uh, two from and the same snowflake but the design of the belly band and of the uh, kind of like card holder it's different and then we do have there ho 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 season greetings and merry christmas card which will go inside oh this one so i'm gonna reinforce all three of these circles and reinforce all these three tags on the same card so i'm gonna glue it and then fussy cut out again so i do have reinforced these tags i'm gonna take my crocodile and punch the hole in that white circle and i will add their uh, eyelets i like the look of the metal on my pieces so I'm gonna add to each of these tags eyelet and I was fussy cutting that white cardstock around my tag with a small gap. Come on, hold. Oh 
there were two t- <laughs> there were two inside in in uh, like together two <laughs> two eyelids that's funny <laughs> so i do have double layer of metal here oh also you haven't noticed that So I do have <clears throat> my decorative mini tags and I'm going to punch the hole in these small snowflake circle tags as well, that one eighth of inch. And I'm just going to hang them <clears throat> once I do have that card holder done or I'm, I'm gonna use it more like inserts for my journals but as, as I said it can be card holder so I'm gonna hang them later on my card holder so I do have here one of these holders I'm gonna grab the ruler and my scoring tool this one it does have small ball here on the end so with that, I'm going to score these score lines. It will help me to fold it nicely. I'm just going to go with this scoring tool on these score lines. And usually... <clears throat> I would use distress ink, but because this should be kind of like mm, very soft Christmas theme, I may will use distress ink just inside. It will have pattern all around. So I'm thinking I will just distress the inside and this will go right here like this. So I'm going to grab my distress tool and distress ink. So today I'm going to be using uh, Distress Ink from Spectrum Noir, uh, it's called Smoked Pearl. And it does have kind of like grey tone, and I really like this this, two, the, this Distress Ink. It does have beautiful, beautiful grey tone. I don't want to have there um, too much kind of like dark tone. So just very softly. And maybe I will go around the edges here. But really very softly, and I think too much um, dark. Yeah, just like this, not more. I can glue together my pocket. And I've got here <coughs> this holder, so I'm going to do the same. Uh, this is that kind of like belly band around that mock. So I'm going to do the same. I'm going to score these lines here and here in the middle. will be like belly band around the mock. I'm gonna put the glue here on this small fold, glue it together
and add a little bit of this smoked pearl on the edges but really just a very small amount nothing too dark and I do have here these cards and these cards this it's going on the front so now where oh yeah this is back on back I do have this one or you can swap it you know it doesn't matter where you will place it and I would like to have these kind of like pop-up uh, thingies on these belly bands so I'm gonna take double-sided foam tape and reinforce these small things first I'm gonna distress it as well with same ink just the edges Now I'm going to take the double-sided tape and I'm going to place the double-sided tape on the back of my pieces. And as I said, it doesn't have to be <clears throat> like a card, card holder. It can be like really cute insert in your journal where you will write your thoughts, maybe some quotes. take my belly band and I'm gonna put these small toppers on that belly band one here and the other one on that opposite side Now I can slide it around like this and I can take <clears throat> one of these cards and just slide it in. I've got here these cute tags so I can uh, put these tags maybe with, uh, with safety pin together. And I found in my stuff this beautiful ball chain. So I'm going to be using that ball chain to put my mini tacks together. Because more metal, better for me. I like that look. So I'm going to just put them together. And I can either do some small hole uh, in this card. And place it through to that hole and hang it from that card or I can just slide it behind that belly band it will be hanging here or I can slide it into that pocket and it will be hanging from there so it can be a really cute decoration I'm gonna keep this as an insert to my uh, Christmas journal so I'm gonna finish both of these and I will show you how you can mix and match it mix and match all these belly bands with all these uh, cups so I do have done my three inserts or card holder and what is perfect about this uh, here you do have that from the uh, two from you can place it either way or you can mix these belly bands that's totally up to you how you will put it together 
And what is perfect about this is that uh, if you want to make it as a card holder, gift card holder, you just need just some gift card. Measure how big the card is. Make small marks next to that card. Take a ruler and knife. And in this line, you just need to cut the slot between those marks you just made. Then grab your card and slide it into that slot. And you can place it back to your card holder. Oh, go there, go there, go there. And most important, there is lots of space, so you can add there also tea or back of coffee. And then you've got it. You've got beautifully wrapped gift card holder, tea holder. You know, it can be used so many ways. And as I said, I'm going to uh, have this as my insert for my <laughs> Christmas journal. So I'm going to find some pocket. And I'm going to place it into that pocket. I just need to take off my card <laughs> from my nails. <laughs> that doesn't belong there. And I am able to kind of lift it there. So then I will be totally confused. Where is my card? So I'm going to keep these as my inserts for my Christmas journal. But as I said, you can totally make it as your Christmas card and send with this also tea or coffee or something, you know. So this is my sharing for today. I do hope you did enjoy it. I hope you will like these digitals. The link for these digitals will be down below. They are now on my Etsy. This is all my sharing for today. Thank you so, so much for sharing your time with me. Thank you so much for visiting me today. If you like this video, please share that with your friends on your social media. Uh, help me to grow up this channel. If I will appreciate that very, very much. Thank you so much. Have a beautiful day. Take care about yourself and I will see you soon. Bye.